Hi, welcome to Simply Scuba. This is the Mara's Puck Pro dive computer. It's a simple one button design, very lightweight, great for entry level divers, but also supports some more technical features like night shocks and also automatic gas switching. So we're going to run through some of the features and screens that you'll see on the computer. So the Mara's Puck Pro uses a single button operation using a press or press and hold uh, sort of system to navigate through the menus. When the computer is turned on, display with the dive mode. It's currently set on nitrox, so it's currently showing the oxygen content and also the maximum operating depth for that mix. To navigate through the menus, just push on the button and you're taken into the main menus and you can basically push the button to cycle through the different options. So we've got modes and you can basically set the, uh, the type of diving you're doing, whether it's air, nitrox or bottom timer. Set is basically all the settings for the dive modes and also units. Logbook, so you can see your previous dives. Dive planner will show you obviously the maximum depths depending on your saturation levels and nitrox mix. PC mode for the uh, optional interface, so you can download your dive profiles. And info mode for just displaying the information such as serial number for the dive computer and then back to the dive mode. To go into any of the options, just scroll to the one you want, hold down the button, and then you're into the submenu. So in the mode button, in the mode option, sorry, we've got the air, nitrox, and bottom timer settings. And there's also a back option there, basically to select going back up a step in the menu. To go into or select any of them, literally hold down the button. For air, for instance, it's now set as an air computer. If you want to set it to nitrox, scroll to the nitrox options, hold down the button, and it takes you into setting up your nitrox mix. You can push the button to increase the digits. So pushing that button will obviously make it 37, 38, and scroll through, obviously back down to 21%. Uh, to select it, hold the button, We'll move on to the next one. You can adjust the PPO2 if you want to, or you can hold down select, and that's now enabled the computer for nitrox. It's also put you back on, onto the back option, so you can down, hold down the button and be taken up one step in the menu. Moving on, you can adjust the settings on the computer. Hold down the button, so you've got dive and time settings, and obviously the back option. Hold that button for dive, and in here you can basically set the backlight option whether you want on or off, and you've got your personal preference on conservative, so you can make it a little bit uh, safer. You can set the altitude, you can also set the water type, whether it's salt or fresh, and also the units, obviously meters and Celsius or feet and Fahrenheit. You can also turn uh, the fast ascent on or off. Obviously, it's not advised to turn it off, but it will disable uh, fast ascents. If you do ascend too rapidly, there won't be any audible alarms, obviously, just no to notify you. You can also turn all your alarms off completely. And you can also erase all desaturation history uh, if you need to. And then you've got the back option. In time, you can set whether it's 12 or 24 hour, just by holding down and pushing the button to select AM or PM or 24 hour, hold down to select, and you can move on. Time mode, so you can obviously adjust the time, pushing the button will increase the time, holding down, we'll move on to the next option. You can obviously adjust the date as well. And then back, so hold down the button for back, we'll step up. Logbook. Overview of your dive history, so there's nothing in it really. Obviously just a few test dives. And then back. Dive planner. Shows you your current selected mix. And you can basically increase the depth to show your Nova decompression limits. 
up to your maximum operating depth, depending on your nitrox mix. PC mode. In this, we've ready selected there. It's obviously ready for interface with a PC to transfer your dive profiles. And you've got the back option just to step up. Info shows the information for the computer, serial numbers, battery life. And then pressing the button, we'll go back to the info, and then you're back to the dive mode. So it's a very simple system to navigate, pretty intuitive. It does do gas switching, you can add a second gas, but it is an automatic switch. It will notify you when it's safe to, to switch over, and then you can just confirm it. So it's a pretty intuitive system, as I said. It does nitrox with the built-in dive planner as well. Very useful tool. That's the Mares Puck Pro.